Hey, hey, doesn't that guy behind me look like Mr. Feeney? Oh, don't even. <laughs> Feeney moved to Wyoming, okay? I have closed that chapter in my life, and I've opened up a new one. And you know what I call that chapter, Jack? Chapter five. <laughs> No, you know what? I think he's right. He does look like the guy in the poster by your bed. How you doing? You think that that kid's Feeny? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. All right, let's test him. I'm gonna ask him a question that only Feeny would know the answer to. Are you George Feeny? It's me, you moron. Hello, Mr. Matthews. Hello, Mr. Hunter. How are you doing? And Miss... Uh... McGuire, Rachel. George Feeney. Oh, it's so nice to meet you. Eric talks about you all the time. Oh. It's such a pleasure to finally meet Eric's grandpa. <laughs> you what? Maybe someday. <laughs> so, Mr. Feeney, what are you doing here? I mean, I thought you were retired. No, he couldn't stay away from me. He's conveniently come back to teach this class. Actually, I came back to be a student. Wait, so you're not retired anymore? Retired life didn't turn out to be what I was looking for, Mr. Matthews. Hello, everybody. Welcome to developmental psychology. I'm Dean Bolander. I've had a rotten morning, and I don't check my mood at the door. Oh, my. <laughs> Down, boy. Our first group project will be an exploration of human nature. Is a person able to alter a trait ingrained in his behavioral makeup since childhood? Now, for this study, you will each need to choose a partner. I call Jack. <laughs> what are you doing? I knew you'd ask Rachel to be your partner, so I got to you before you could get to her. <laughs> Want to be partners, Mr. Feeney? Delighted, Miss McGuire. Why didn't you just ask Rachel before I got the chance? It's hard to say. <laughs> You know, I don't have a lot of control over what goes on up here. So in conclusion, watches, chocolate, cheese. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we give you the Swiss. Thank you. Eric, you were supposed to prove something. He did. <laughs> okay, folks, I think that's about all we can take today. I'll see you all on Thursday. Ah. Uh, I am so sorry. I bet you have a really strong first impression of us, huh? Indelible. <laughs> you know something, Dean? This didn't all come from me. My boy Jackie here deserves the same grade I do. <gasps> Done. <laughs> George, I look forward to your call. Fine. Fine. Dude, let's go. <laughs>